you stupid fucking cunt, all you do is complain, complain. Bob gets the TV to work, but it's running a message from the emergency broadcast system. What the hell is that? One of them test things. The movie Legion in Paradise Falls. Yes, this is one of those tests that clearly says that this is not a test. Oh shit, oh shit, oh! A complete Jesus freak. <laughs> what about the baby? I got it under control. But it's gonna burn. What'd you just say? I said your fucking baby's gonna burn. Oh shit, oh shit, oh! Shut up, you stupid fucking cunt! All you do is complain, 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 complain! You're dying of this, you're dying of that. Your mom's dying of this, your dad's dying of that. You need to get to the Fountain of Youth before you're dead. The biggest secret that's been kept from you is that the Fountain of Youth is right over there. And uh, I have the mythical demon codes. I'm going to throw the bridge keeper off the bridge, motherfucker. Everybody else is like zombies lost at sea. They can't see anything. They don't know what the fuck is going on. So, you know, I have to lead this exodus. If I don't, nobody will. And we need to get to the pole. The very center of the flat earth plane. The north pole is the pole star where all the stars spin around. The south pole is the center of the dish. The north side of your compass is seeking a south pole. You go into a church and make the upside down cross. Going from your head to your chest left to right. You've been worshipping Satan your entire life. Jesus freak. <laughs> what about the baby? I got it under control. But it's gonna burn. What'd you just say? I said your fucking baby's gonna burn. Shut up, you stupid fucking cunt. All you do is complain, complain. That's because you're living in hell. That's Helios above your head. You have a double helix. You say hello. How's your health? Help! You need to get to the center of the flat earth plane before you're dead and bathe in this lake of fire. You're going to cast yourself in with 144,000 living beings. And we're going to come back here eternal. Bring forth heaven and earth. Get everybody passage into the Garden of Eden. And nobody will stop me. It's that the angel of death is my blood brother. We both gave up our free will. We follow a book. I follow the book of life. The angel of death follows the book of death, motherfucker. You will join me or expire. There's no way to fuck this up. I put up blood for the angel of death. So this angel could be released from having to murder people or kill people by the book. It's just that simple. And uh, now I'm being trained to take over the position, motherfucker. I need to get us all to the Holy Grail before we're dead. Say hi to the camera. I'm taking you to a place worse than hell. Uh, a place worse than hell. forth heaven and earth and release everybody from bondage. You see, I published this video. I intend on closing out the book of death for my blood brother, the angel of death. And I can see I'm being trained to take over the position. I need to get us all to the Holy Grail before we're dead. I guess that means you're in trouble. The angel of death is going to find you. Motherfucker, her up for them. We shall fix that. Believe me. We'll offer them. We shall fix that. Believe. I love you. God bless you. We shall fight. We I love you. God bless you. We shall fight. We We shall die. We will die. Ignorance of the law excuses no one. Your creator requires atonement for your sins, and you're laughing your ass off. I'm telling you as Satan himself, this is my fucking world because you're so filthy, 
fucking retarded. You're officially dead in a necrophiliac. I leave for heaven in a nice new ship. Hurry. Let me express some Yes, we can. Make you safe. The good guy is Satan. He's known as the supreme architect of the universe, who has promised that we shall never, never die. I have the spear of fucking destiny. I got you, Satan. Eventually, it's going to set in that I'm standing here as Satan on gallons of blood. It is said to be a place where any kind of wish can be fulfilled, even resurrecting the dead. Like, there's powers within your governments, and we, we're the underdog. We may seem wild and crazy, but that's because we've been the meat crap. And we're the, the universe always has a way to respond to the underdog. Like, we've worked hard to get this far, standing our ground against battles that people can't comprehend. Yeah. And we're trying to bring forth the end of days, like, dazed and confused. It's the end of days. No more days. Once you get this That's knowledge, you need to people. wake up. The truth is what scares people. You need to apply this knowledge to your life so you can live. Get in their boots. You're not, gonna, you're not gonna get this in your school. You're not gonna get this in your church. You're not gonna get this from your government. You're not gonna get this on your television. You're gonna get this from- Revolution Mark will Bond, not be televised. The blood over intent, the real truthers the blood over ten those that don't bear false witness to the man that opened the book of life the only reason i even have a chapter in the book of life as the merlin of avalon is because of mark braun and the blood that he spilled to open this book and he didn't have to tell anybody if he didn't explain the book of life to us we'd all be dead and it's the truth because nobody was going to tell you about the holy grail they were going to leave that out they're just going to show you the vortex in every movie. They just hide the Holy Grail and everything. You start breaking down the symbolism of all the logos, the cartoons. Everything is showing you. Get to the center of the dish. And they just turn it into a story and they distract you with some love story and drama and excitement and explosions and sex, drugs, and rock and roll until you're just brainwashed and blocked in the bottom three chakras, hex at your heart, all day long, sealing your fate to death. Every word you speak, it's, that's where we are. We have to break the spell. This is kind of funny. You know, I should be able to sue people for defamation of character. You know, it's clear who holds the spear of destiny. It's clear who is the Prince of Darkness standing on gallons of motherfucking blood. The Spear of Destiny. The Lucius Trust Fund. If I don't drag you off to the Fountain of Youth, you're gonna fucking die. I require proof of life. It's called atonement for your sins, motherfucker. And I wouldn't take your soul if you were giving it away for free. You're a little piece of shit monster. Lost at sea, you're legally dead. And I'm going to squash you out like a little cockroach. You better place your blood up published right beside my own on the YouTube. It's real simple. You write it on a piece of paper. I intend to bring forth heaven on earth. You pinprick your finger with a needle or you wait for your next fucking boo-boo. And you spread your blood over those words. And you publish video proof of it right beside my own and your blood brethren. Under blood over intent in the title. The description blood over intent and the tag blood over intent. What happens is your blood becomes side by side. Blood is thicker than water with me and your blood brethren. And the angel of death will literally pass you by. I'm explaining to you that I am Satan himself in the flesh standing on gallons upon gallons of my own blood. Nobody can overturn it without killing themselves. This is my world now. Nobody gets to the Garden of Eden without me. You will join me or expire. I don't take your money. I don't want your worship. And I don't want your fucking advice. I'm going to pay the way, pave the way for everybody. Bring forth heaven on earth. Release everybody from bondage. And nobody will stop me. You're all a bunch of filthy, retarded cockroaches. And uh, I'm ready to squash you out. I'm sorry. 
and I know nobody can stop me. I'm here by divine order. It's that you will join me or expire of your own fucking stupidity. It's just that simple. You know, nobody's going to drag your ass off to the fountain of youth. You're a silly human slave who knows nothing of truth. It's clear who holds the spear of destiny. The angel of death is my blood brother. Who the fuck says this shit and gets away with it? Only Satan himself gets away with this shit. Standing on gallons of motherfucking blood. Millions upon millions of witnesses. Thousands upon thousands of others. Published with their blood beside my own. In a common cause of survival. To bring forth heaven on earth. And release everybody from bondage. Get everybody passage into the Garden of Eden. We'll grab these seeds. Come back here. Plant these giant trees. They rub it in your face in every movie. It's clear this is my fucking world. And you couldn't sell me your soul. Oh my god, you couldn't give it away. I am the fucking anti-messiah. I am the fucking anti-Christ. Satan himself. The prince of darkness. The prince of demons. The prince of the air. I fly above all weather, for heaven's sakes. If you don't join me, and your brethren, you will surely expire. The angel of death is literally one with me, motherfucker. I put up the blood. Not you, bitch. So if I was you... I'd publish your blood beside my own. I don't fuck around, and neither does the angel of death, and neither does your grand architect. That force, whatever you want to call it, the infinite potential of the Earth's memory, is requiring blood sacrifice, your own pinprick of your fucking blood over the words, I intend to bring forth heaven and earth and release everybody from bondage. If you don't do this, you're in the book of death for a good reason. You raise your children to think that they're on a ball floating through space as monkeys. It's an accident, but you're in a fixed Computer, one electron, one positron, one light hole, one black hole on loop. Through the transaction comes the infinite potential, the aurora borealis, the Earth's memory. It hits the dome and showers down on you like the matrix code. You're in the fucking computer simulation, the land of the dead, motherfucker. You went to grammar school to learn your book of the dead. They took your soul print from you at birth. Okay, you're legally dead. The world is mine and you don't have to like it. Okay, unless you got gallons of blood to spill up right now without killing yourself on video and publishing it to the YouTube for the universe to see. I'm sorry. You're going to do all that to do my job for me? Okay? I'll gladly hand you the book of demon codes if you could spill up gallons of your own motherfucking blood. But you can't. You're a little pussy. <laughs>